Well, the 2024 total solar eclipse is in exactly a year and a week from now, and preparations are already underway as it's supposed to draw the crowds right here to Central Texas. Six News anchor Bailey Bates attended the town hall meeting earlier tonight, and she joins us live in the studio with what you need to know as Central Texas prepares for totality. Bailey. Well, Lindsay, city leaders and organizations are really wanting everyone to get on board with this rare event as the area is being highlighted on an international level. So Inside if, the Brazos Ballroom uh, at the Waco Convention so. Center, plans for a once in a lifetime opportunity unfolds between the snacks and the puns. It sheds light on our area. Yes, I chose that phrase specifically. <laughs> There's an effort to get Waco on board for totality. So the reason why you, we call this one of the most viscerally important four minutes of your life is that it's going to be just amazing. We guarantee it will change your life. Experts say Waco is one of the best places to see the total solar eclipse on April 8, 2024. Perfect. That's why there is an event being planned on Baylor University's campus with the help of Discovery Channel, Lowell Observatory, BU, and Waco Convention and Visitors Bureau. It's so rare the event will be broadcasted around the world. We're going to try to do to make this the hottest place in Texas. You've got to be here for it. Oh yeah, and by the way, we've also got an eclipse on Monday afternoon. They expect a packed weekend full of fun in the day of totality to bring in thousands. The idea that the eyes of North America are going to be on Waco because we're in the path of totality for four minutes of eclipse. Very, very exciting. Heather Venable with Waco Tours says the eclipse is just another way for her and her team to show off all the city and area has to offer. My hope is that the community really, really comes together and links arms instead of what can I do for my business? We can look at each other and say, what can we do for our city? And I really think that that's capturing the spirit of what the organizers are trying to do. All right, so organizers are expected to announce tomorrow how people can attend this viewing experience on Baylor's Ooh. campus. So we're going to keep you updated on that information. But Lindsay, if you go to this event, you get these glasses. It, I mean, it's worth the four minutes, right? <laughs> <laughs> Listen, and we, by the way, if you put them on like with no eclipse around, it just blacks everything out. Yeah, I because can't you're not anything. supposed to stare directly <laughs> at the eclipse. <laughs> You're right here, baby. <laughs> Without these cool glasses. Okay, so tomorrow we'll find out we how will. we can attend. But basically, Waco is going to be the bell of the ball yeah, when it comes absolutely. to this. Absolutely, and it's really exciting. Rare thing. You can only see it this one time. Otherwise, you're going to have to wait like 3,000 years. <laughs> All right, but we do still have to wait a year and a week. Yes. So, <laughs> major heads up on that. All right, Bailey, thank you so much.